Okay. Well, uh, let's give this thing a let's give this thing a shot. Looks complicated. There's a transfer node. There's a data store that I'd love to have. But this is this one is no joke. Okay. Oh, we'll try to get this. Success so far. Used a stop worm. Hopefully, used another one. That's probably not worth it. Access granted. I mean, I succeeded and got 200 credits, but I used two stop worms, so I'm not sure if that was really worthwhile. Ah, and I just went over on time, too. Damn. Alright, well, welcome back to Josiah Plays Deus Ex Human Revolution. Just hacked uh, Captain Penn's uh, office computer. From J. Manderley at Gov to Captain Penn. UV, Captain. Following the recent incident at Seraph Industries, the body of an unidentified male terrorist was delivered to your morgue. I think I've read this. Maybe not. You are hereby advised that this corpse has been classified ultraviolet under the revised Homeland Security Act. In keeping with Article 7, Section 3, under no circumstances is the corpse to be transferred to the city morgue. It must remain in your own facilities until my people arrive to take possession. Pursuant to this, per Section 4, all persons of blue clearance or lower are denied access to your morgue. The medical examiner may remain on site, of course, to keep the body isolated, but there is to be no, repeat, no autopsy performed. These measures will be in place until I deliver the all clear. Thank you for your understanding on this matter. Joseph Manderley, advisor to the Deputy Administrator, National Preparedness. So these people are in on the conspiracy. This is a cover-up. They're trying to cover up that wet, wet wear that was in his brain that caused him to be controlled and the whole thing. So, yeah, the government's partially involved in this conspiracy. The uh, Homeland Security or whatever. Wow. This is, this is getting deeper and deeper. From Dr. Campbell to uh, Captain Penn. More procedures, sir. Today marks the second time this year when I have been prevented from doing my job following an attack on Seraph Industries. If there exists some question about my skill level, my ability to be discreet, or the way I run my lab, I demand it to be brought to my attention immediately. Professional courtesy requires a proper explanation. Dr. Campbell, medical examiner. Yeah, that's right, because they, on, the, on Megan Reed's uh, autopsy, they didn't let him do it either. They brought in somebody from from the federal government to do that too. Yep, mad cover-ups going on here. Homeland Security Criminal Database to Captain Ryan Penn. Query 08016 Zeke Sanders. So here's Zeke Sanders' file. Elgato, Ezekiel Sandoval, 1990 Los Angeles, California. It's probably when he was born. Apollo and Concepcion, that's his parents I assume. Three siblings, 510, 175 currently laying unconscious in an alley. <laughs> Features Hispanic, missing left eye, military tattoos including U.S. Marine Corps sigil. U.S. Marine Corps, Afghanistan, wounded, medical discharge, re-enlisted under recycle military program, operations classified, discharge under cessation act. Attack on civilians in Glendale shopping complex, Los Angeles, 13 injuries, no fatalities, siege and hostage situation. Diagnosed on site as post-traumatic acute dissociation. 
remanded into medical custody. Neuroprosthetic Rehabilitation Center near Camp Topaz, Utah, declared cured six months later and released. Criminal Activities Leader of Anti-Augmentation Domestic Terrorist Group claiming responsibility for numerous acts of breaking and entering, vandalism, theft, arson, targets all associated with augmentation industry. MO of tax consistently involves empty buildings with minimal security personnel, no fatalities, outstanding warrants, should be considered armed and extremely dangerous. Hmm, so he's an interesting character, some interesting stuff going on there. Ah, and here's the evidence I needed. From Manderley to Captain Ryan Pan again. Over and done. Captain, due to the present sensitive context, it is our recommendation that case TA-00514 regarding the terrorist attack on Seraph Industries be filed and closed ASAP. In our opinion, the conclusions proposed at this stage of the investigation are quite satisfactory. Hmm, cover-up. I have appointed a state medical examiner to perform the autopsies on the victims. This is a critical situation and we must try to keep the information contained as tightly as possible. I am certain you understand the public relations nightmare this incident implies and will act promptly and accordingly. Have your men reassigned by the end of the day. Yeah. So yeah, that's twice now that this this J Manderley, this Joseph Manderley, um, has straight up come in and be like, nope, don't do a, don't do, don't ex investigate this any further. We'll handle it. We're covering this up. Have a nice day. Wow. And uh, so motherly ties updated. Return to Cassandra Reed. Looks like I found out everything I can about Megan's murder. Cassandra Reed is waiting for me in the lobby of my apartment complex. I should head to the Chiron building and speak with her. Oh, so she's not just in the same place she was before. Okay. Well, that is really interesting. Really interesting. While I'm here, I might as well hack some more stuff. Clearance would be real good to have. Oh, I'm screwing up bad. And I'm wasting mad nuke viruses. Access denied. Oh no. Okay, well that's unacceptable because not only did I waste two things, I also set off the alarm in there and everything, so that I can't I can't have that. Um latest autosave should be good. Uh, welcome back. Sorry, I um, locked up again as I started loading that. Uh, I, I occasionally have the game lock up while I'm loading a save once in a while and then uh, I have to completely restart it up. Which I thought that patch was going to fix but it didn't apparently. I'm thinking maybe I should stop messing with some of this hacking stuff until I've until, until I've gained a better some better hacking skills, you know, like the stealth thing, a couple points in that and one in in uh you know, the fortify or whatever. But maybe I'll try this one real quick. This is a complicated, interesting one. These are all one way, so... Hmm. Guess I'll get this one first, because...
Oh man, I didn't mean to do that. Ah, oh, this is starting to piss me off. I wasted a thing again and I got nothing out of it. Hold on. I think I'm done hacking right now in here. Until I have some better some better hacking skills or something. Uh Yeah. These hacks have gotten really hard and um I just don't have the enhancements to really do them well. So I advanced this quest, right? Return to Cassandra Reed, yeah. While I'm here, though, I will, um, pick up maybe a combat rifle and a, and a shotgun, and a shotgun, yes, from the armory, collect a little loot. To sell. Okay, yeah, I think I'm, um, I'm done here at the police station for now. Are you supposed to be here, sir? I thought the station had been locked down. Yeah, I'm supposed to be here. What do, what do you mean? Of course. Why wouldn't I be? How do I get out of here? I forgot. Okay, this way. News? Same news. Alright, we'll head back out to uh, the city. Um, probably a good time to go talk to Cassandra Reed. Tell her all the stuff I've uncovered on her daughter's death. Yep. I think that's the plan right now. Need to stop by Gonna stop by Grayson's first though. Run through here. Then I'll go back the other way. The uh, the back alley way or whatever. To get back to my building. What'll it be? I'm going to sell you some stuff, man. That's it. See you soon. All right. And that, I believe, is about all the time I have for this video. So, Thanks for watching. Josiah plays Deus Ex Human Revolution. I'll see you next time.